So you are a CMA or soon to be. That does not guarantee success in today's world. What you also need are seven leadership skills to truly succeed as a management accountant. Stay tuned to discover what those skills are. For anyone on the journey to becoming a CMA, the logistics around getting the certification may be top of mind, but being a CMA involves so much more than just technical skills. I mean, sure, the best CMAs are competent management accountants, but they are also masters of another critical skill, leadership. If you're surprised to hear that, don't worry. You're not alone. Let's talk about the importance of leadership abilities as a CMA and how you can develop the top seven effective skills that will support you in your career. If you're new here, I'm Nathan Liao and I've helped over 37,000 people study for the CMA exam and my mission is to help you too so you can accelerate your career and income to a six-figure salary as a certified management accountant. Walk into any boardroom, office, or startup and you'll find out pretty fast who the leader is. Leadership isn't about a title, it's about influence. And when you develop the ability to influence others, you're well on your way to being an effective leader. In all facets of personal and professional life, leadership skills are respected and admired. Luckily, leadership skills are also transferable. If you develop these seven leadership skills in one area of your life, you'll be able to apply them to other areas as well. Leadership is a critical skill for accounting and finance professionals, especially those who want to excel as CMAs. So here's skill number one. Be a motivator. The ability to motivate a team is a crucial skill for leadership professionals. Management accountants need to know how to best motivate their employees to reach the company goals and department goals. I'm referring to positions such as CFOs, controllers, accounting managers, you name it. If you want to improve people's motivation, start by fostering a culture of gratitude. Display the behavior you want to see. Share gratitude for your employees regularly and reflexively. It will remind them that their role is valuable. Understanding how to motivate others will ultimately support you in your success because it will help you learn your people, what drives them, and what makes them tick. Those are the motivating factors that you can tap into. Once you discover how to motivate your employees as individuals, you'll be able to foster a powerhouse team that tackles challenges and overcomes obstacles. Number two, actively listen. Communication skills are about more than just expressing your thoughts and ideas. Leaders must be listeners. It is the only way to really know your people to keep a finger on the pulse of culture shifts and concerns, and to be proactively engaged in advancing goals. Active listening can improve every interaction you have with a team member. It is a key part of skilled leadership and coaching. Do your listening skills need work? To become a better listener, choose to believe that every person you meet has the potential to teach you something new. This mindset will transform your interactions with every member of your team. With well-developed active listening skills, you can encourage your team to come to you with new ideas, innovate, and support your own business goals. And CMAs, who often land in roles like a CFO or corporate controller, exercise leadership skills to communicate effectively, relate to others, and motivate teams to crush goals. Are leaders born or made? What do you think? Let me know in the comments below and let's start a conversation. Leaders in every organization have the immense responsibility for the team members. As a leader, you guide the direction of a company and every individual who's in it. Big responsibility, but also game changing if you do it right. Number three, inspire your people. When you manage people, they look to you for authority and direction. Inspiring others means leading by example. The ability to inspire may seem similar to motivation, but there are a few key differences. A CMA's ability to inspire means they can get their team invested in the success of the company. They create a fulfilling and exciting work environment. And when they establish goals, they illustrate their importance, not only to the company, but for the greater good. 
Motivation can grow from inspiration, but not the other way around. Inspiration must come from the leader of a team or organization. So never underestimate a leader who has the fantastic ability to inspire others. They are the ones who lead teams to do world-changing work. Number four, cast a creative vision. Creativity in leadership is a critically undervalued skill. Creativity is the ability to make something new, and CMAs can do this through leadership in multiple ways. CMAs may develop innovative ways of budgeting, new profit sharing initiatives, or workflows that endure disruptions such as labor shortages and hybrid work arrangements very popular today. The greatest leaders in the world are visionaries who can think outside the box. Embrace opportunities to be creative in all facets of your work. Number five, manage with purpose. Organization, delegation, decision-making, and even communication are all essential management skills. These will be especially important in your career as a CMA. Team sports, clubs, professional groups, and even managing virtual working groups are great ways to develop these fundamental leadership skills that will help you throughout your career. You can start developing purposeful management skills in any context. And once you have a solid foundation, it should be easy for you to learn how to continuously improve purpose-driven management and coaching. Your team will love you for it. If you are enjoying this video, hit the subscribe and like button to help reach more people like you who want to learn how to become effective leaders at work. Bottom line, leadership skills are important. So what are the last two skills you must develop as a CMA to be an effective leader? Number six, foster team spirit. A leader's ability to sense someone's potential and draw out the best in them is the key to creating teams that support each other's strengths. Team building is about more than just planning, budgeting, and hiring. Once your team is formed, it's about cultivating an environment that encourages everyone to care about each other's success. And great leaders highlight and support the strengths of each team member and encourage the entire team to do the same. This will ensure your team looks out for each other and functions as one unit. Number seven, lead with empathy. And this is the last and arguably the most important skill that leaders develop and that helps them with their career, which is empathy. In every area of your professional life, you will benefit from practicing empathy. Empathy is a key part of your emotional intelligence. And studies have shown that leaders with a high EQ score or emotional quotient score can make a broader impact that yields positive results. Leaders who possess an abundance of empathy have stronger relationships and can motivate and inspire others. They have superior management abilities, more freedom for creative collaboration, and the trust of their team, which is so important. In addition to the cultural and social benefits of developing leadership skills, there is a financial one. The studies have found that people with great leadership skills are likely to earn more money. The managerial and leadership understanding of a CMA is reflected in a higher salary as well as taking a seat in the C-suite and other positions of authority. I'll share next how much you can earn as a CMA, but first let's do a quick recap of what we've covered. Leadership is a critical skill for accounting and finance professionals, and here are the top seven skills. Well, number one, be a motivator. Number two, actively listen. Number three, inspire your people. Number four, cast a creative vision. Number five, manage with purpose. Number six, foster team spirit. And number seven, lead with empathy. If you need resources to help you pass the exam, download my free CMA exam cheat sheet in PDF format. It's packed with the nine best strategies to ace the exam. And the download link is in the show notes. How much can you make per year as a CMA with strong leadership skills? Watch this next video to learn more. I'll see you there.